and good morning and happy Monday. Good morning, happy Monday, and welcome back to Quarters Without Borders. Jada Wright, good morning. Hope you're having a fantastic start to your week. Hope you've had a fantastic day so far. Welcome back, everybody. It is another bright, sunny, beautiful day full of positive energy, and I am thankful to be here sharing it with you. I'm your host. My name is Kyle. And we here, basically, we're doing our best to play today for a better tomorrow. It is Monday, March 8th, 2021. And we're here to conclude our adventures in Sonic Generations. 10 out of 10. That is a good way to describe the weather today. It's sunny, right? Once again, the uh, ultraviolet awesome radiation is traveling through the cosmos, striking me. The sun's actually getting a little bit further. The trajectory of the sun as it traverses from east to west across the sky, it's starting to shift further north as us here in the northern hemisphere as it starts to get into springtime. So it's actually, it's finally above the lip of my window. So I don't have the direct sun beating down on my face, but it is beating down on my legs. So... <laughs> I'm sure as the weeks go on, that cadence was changed. It was hot. What kind of temperature are you looking at? We're looking at like 50s and 60s Fahrenheit all week this week. Which at least for central Ohio, it's nice after what we've had. Oh, all right. So, if you're joining us for the very first time, let me welcome you to our little corner of the internet, where we do our best to play video games and, and raise money for charity. Right now, we're playing our way through 15 degrees Celsius. Now, I unfortunately got to do some smartphone-assisted math here. Okay, that's about 59 degrees Fahrenheit, according to Google. So basically, we're sitting at about the exact same temperature. That's kind of neat. bonding across the internet folks <laughs> it comes, yeah it comes up to 59 so we're, we're actually about the same temperature which is really quite fascinating and now i know 15 degrees celsius is 59 degrees fahrenheit <laughs> all right but um if you're joining us for the very first time let me welcome you to our little corner of the internet um, where we play video games and raise money for charity right now we're playing our way through sonic generations um, a game from 2000 and uh, blah, 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 11, 2011, if I remember correctly. Oh man, that's my brain right there. Either way, it's one, in my opinion, one of the better Sonic titles because it has a beautiful fusion of both classic 2D side-scrolling Sonic action and 3D like platforming style Sonic action. So we're made it, we're on the final boss now. We're going to see how far we can go. And we've got a special system set up based upon mission completion times and deaths that allow us to track our progress and raise money for charity. Now, everything that we're raising for this game is going to Child's Play. Child's Play. They've been around since 2003. Bam, there's where my numbers are getting mixed up. Um, but they're an organization that provides games, toys, things like that for um, children in participating hospitals. And they have branches worldwide. Um, since their inception, I believe if you go to their website, they've raised a grand total of over $44 million. So it's a really um, large organization, but a really cool cause. And we've raised a grand total of $56.75. So the way it works, um, Every minute it takes us to complete a level is equivalent to one quarter donated. That's going to round up. Every minute of gameplay is one quarter. So it's encouraging us to play faster and faster and faster. However, every death, every retry, every game over ups that quarter multiplier by one. Now, we left off in the midst of a boss fight on Thursday. So we left off with 
times three multiplier already earned and we're not going to scrub that that's going to stay on there as we start back today uh, that's what we're going to pick up most likely we'll be able to finish the game today i'm hoping at least and um we'll go from there if you want to learn more about child's play there should be a button right below the stream that'll link you directly to their website if you want to support them directly they are a 501c3 charity which means um, your donations should be taxed right off a bowl, but check your local laws and regulations for more details. Bam. Okay, I think that's everything, folks. So $56.75, and let's keep going. Let's dive into it today, right? So Jaderate, how was your weekend, my friend? Up to anything exciting? Or a chill weekend, or a chill weekend? Make sure these stay on my head. All right, back to the Egg Dragoon. So we had a bit of a system kind of worked out from last time. Um, it just, he had a lot of health. Let's do this. The Egg Dragoon. Pruning or Are you serious? You were pruning or- Do you have orchards? Like, you were straight up pruning, I mean, when you say pruning orchards, I imagine, like, you have orchard trees of some sort. And just because of the season, you needed to, like, pair them back and stuff? Or is this, like, an analogy for something? <laughs> I guess that's my question. Because <laughs> that sounds pretty legit. What kind of trees do you have? If you literally mean you had an orchard. Fruits of different- are you serious, dude? That's awesome. Dude, what kind of so what, I mean, if you don't mind sharing, what kind of fruit do you What kind of fruit do you um, deal with? Apricots, plums, peaches. Ch what? Wow. That's amazing. I know growing up we used to have a plum tree in our front yard, and that was kind of neat. Dude, but that's a whole different level. That's so cool. Oh, what a waste. So much for that. Well, with the weather you had, it sounds like it would have been really nice day to be outside working in, like, the orchard. Orchard. So I'm realizing something with this boss fight. When he does his, like, two little walls that you ninja jump off of, this, this attack right here, as long as you go immediately and you never stop wall jumping, you'll never hit his attacks. Like, that seemed to have been an oversight. <laughs> like, basically, as long as you just go without pausing, you'll never miss him and he'll never hit you. Yeah, come on, dude. We're killing it today. Woo! I need a rampy dude. Okay, from the rampy do. Need to get close enough. Yes! Okay, we got it. Okay, now we're in the alternate dimension. Now this, I have to remember we can go forward somehow. There we go, the X button. 
Ugh. Getting closer. Oh, come on. We're so close. Get it. Nice. Wait, you had a you had negative three temperatures this morning, and you still had sixty degrees. Sorry, I didn't get a chance to read the whole thing there. How that cold won't kill the season when they put these flowers pretty early. So, do you do you have like your orchard or I keep saying orchid? Do you have your orchard? Just wow. Oh, minus three Celsius. I'm sorry. Here's my brain thinking minus three <laughs> Fahrenheit to like 60 degrees Fahrenheit. Minus three Celsius. Okay, I understand. It's still a climb though. Ah. Oh. So, do you keep your or orchard just for yourself, or do you like do you sell fruit? We had a lot of hearts or brings there for a minute. Enough to even get an extra life out of the whole thing. Okay, shoot your little ice balls. Oh, hey, it's Jose. Happy Monday, sir. Oh, it was way too early. Dude, come on down and let me attack you. Man, that sounds amazing, Jader, right? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh! Getting a window to attack him again is getting rather difficult. He's not really providing an opportunity. Thank you, Jose. It is a happy Monday. Imagine you're probably getting the same weather we are over here. Which is beautiful and warm. Come on, dude. Like, what are you waiting on? I can jump. And that never gets close enough to attack him. What am I missing? Dodge the fire. Should I get closer to him, I guess? I'm not really using my boost. Maybe I should use my boost to see if that adds anything. Because I feel like I've, I'm missing something. This is like the third time we've done this little loop. And he hasn't done anything different. We're sustaining, right? We're not dying. But we're clearly... Missing something. He's not doing his easy attack where I get like a guaranteed hit on him anymore. I'm back here again. 
Oh, I missed it. Are you kidding me? If I get close enough, I can still get him, though. Oh, really? That's not good. Where'd I go? There I go. Oh. I know, he kind of like hangs out really low. I definitely think I have to play with the boost a little bit more. Like, he just sits just outside of your range. Like, the faster you go, the faster he goes, kind of a thing. I, I can't, I, you know, I feel like there's a moment I need to be able to get close enough to him. When he's in the, uh... The other phase, this one. Oh. He just keeps his distance so well, though. Got him! All right. Okay, parallel dimension. We close the distance again. Oh, okay. That wasn't good. Closer, closer. Closer. Come on, a little closer. Closer! Woo! <laughs> that was so anticlimactic. Okay. That only took 10 minutes. With our times 3 multiplier from last week. We didn't die again, though. Oh, now we have to team up. The real boss battle is about to begin. I can't believe this. I was supposed to beat this time. Ah, I'm sorry. I didn't get that memo. I beat you every time. No, seriously. We beat this guy every time. It's like it's our job or something. What's Eggman even doing here? I thought you said he'd been kidnapped by that big weird thing that sent us all to this place. What about Dr. Robotnik? It'd be cool if there was two of them. Eggman and Dr. Robotnik. Ah. Lady Dragana, good morning, good morning. We managed to beat it. On our first try, actually. Okay, so there's a little bit more going on. You can now access and explore the next, uh, the next area. So, Dr. Eggman, we beat. One more Chaos Emerald to go. But, um, Dr. Robotnik is still out there. Whoa. Maybe there's a little bit more to this game than I remember, folks. It's not quite over. These gears are broken. If you insert a Chaos Emerald into each gear, its power may be able to repair it. Collect all Chaos Emeralds to repair the gears. Am I missing one? Or is there one in this area? Gotta juice it up. Well, let's put some Chaos Emeralds back. Dun dun dun. Ooh, ticking sound too, that's kinda cool. This is so neat. <laughs> oh. There we go. Oh. 
Oh. Lady Dragana, how is your Monday morning going? I mean, the picture, I think, shows needing seven. We'll see. I don't think we have the last one. I dig the tick-tocking sounds. Well, let's find out. It's just six. Or I've got them all, apparently. Yeah, apparently I do have all seven. Whoa. It's a chaotic morning. As in, like, Chaos Emerald kind of chaotic. Sounds like you need some Sonic in your life. I guess that last Chaos Emerald must be a different co must be a color that we have. It just looks very clear. Wow, do we go in? I think we should go in. I'm over this week. <laughs> oh no. I'm sorry to hear that. It's not even noon on Monday yet. I like the like the weird wavy the weird wavy reflection in this portal. Because it actually has a real-time reflection. Like, you can see it's actually modern Sonic back there getting distorted. And it's classic Sonic getting distorted. That's a nice little touch. <laughs> oh, I could just... I could just imagine, like, Jaderite pulling a Kool-Aid man and just, like, busting through your wall, Lady Dragana, and being like... <laughs> oh, yeah! Oh dang, he's got a lot of arms. Okay, whatever you are. If you want to avoid an embarrassing beatdown, you better give up now. You're not in a position to demand anything, you nasty little pincushion. Eggman? But how? He had a little help. Dr. Robotnik! Nobody calls me that anymore. If you would be so kind as to explain, gentleman genius Dr. Eggman from the future. <laughs> it will be my pleasure, most excellent and efficacious Dr. Eggman of the past. It's Dr. Robotnik. After my most recent setback, I stumbled upon the primordial form of this unique creation, which I discovered had amazing abilities even I have never been able to master. It could erase time and space. I then had the brilliant idea to use my discovery to undo my previous defeats. Spoilers. Spoiler alert. In order to perfect it, <laughs> I needed the help of somebody as smart as I am. The only person that smart is me. Oh, you are too kind, my dear future self. And I was happy to help. I captured your friends, flinging them through time to bait my traps. But the more your monster tears through time, the more damage you do to the world. The world? I'm going to own the world when I'm finished with Sonic! <laughs> I love the fact that they have both Robotnik. They at least acknowledge the villain of my childhood. <laughs> wow, will I really get that crazy? <laughs> <laughs> we'll see who's crazy after I destroy both Sonics. <laughs> Forever. You mean, after we destroy them? Less arguing, more destroying. Destroy me? You and what mustache? I beat you all the time by myself, and now there's two of me. Then I'll have twice as much fun defeating you. I mean, this is basically like Avengers Endgame Sonic the Hedgehog version. I know, right? <laughs> That's what I was thinking. <laughs> yeah, 
he literally has the ability to do anything. Anything. <laughs> He's like, I'm gonna disrupt their picnic. <gasps> that was just to soften you up. Now it's time to meet your doom. Do it, Sonic! Come on, Sonic! Smack him! Uh, not you! You got this, Sonic. The power of friendship. Sonic. Who are they? They are insignificant. You've got the power, Sonic. Focus your spirit. We're with you guys. I believe in you, Sonic. Don't give in, Sonic. I know you can do this, Sonic. You can win, Sonic. You always do. Man, my ten-year-old self is getting goosebumps. Goosebumps on the inside. I know, right? They all just... They just stood there. <laughs> oh, two Supersonics. So I'll admit, I've never, like, playing Sonic the Hedgehog 2, my first game, on Genesis. I've never actually collected all the Chaos Emeralds, and I've never earned Super Sonic on the OG game. The Time Eater. I mean, he's doing stuff. I'm s Okay, I'm playing as the one on the... I don't know what's happening. Okay, I can fly. I'm like... This is like Dragon Ball Z. I'm just going like Super Saiyan. Well, we'll just dodge it. Okay, I switched. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, I'm like two-dimensional Sonic now. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing. Okay, we'll just dodge it. Oh, wow. Keep dodging, keep dodging. Okay, now we're in 3D. don't understand. Okay, I can charge him up and shoot him. Interesting. Okay, so this is how this Sonic works. I basically charge up my buddy and I can shoot him like a missile for some reason. Not sure what that does. There's that big, like, red thing up there. Whoa! Maybe I should have looked at the, the, the tool tips. Dude, it's totally Dragon Ball Z. There we go. Okay, he's knocking stuff down. I'm bleeding rings. I guess just existing in a parallel dimension. Oh no, I need rings. Okay, switching. I need rings! What does this tech do? Ooh, okay, there we go. Look at the rings! Okay, we got a couple. This is... Rings! 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 Go! Oh, that seemed really good, right? Okay, but what good does that do me? Great, we got 17 lives. 
<laughs> That's funny, the homing shot missiles didn't change angles. Oh, we are so toast. I'm aware of that. But do I want to switch? That's the question. We are toast. We are so toast. Rings! Rings! Okay, okay. What are we trying to do here? Other buttons, other buttons, right? That switches. I can switch whenever I want. And I can boost. And I can team up like this. Lady Dragon, what movie did you end up watching this weekend? I wanted to ask you that a second ago. Switch! Okay, why are we like in a weird direction right now? We are not traveling in the direction. I think we just broke the geometry. We are like out of the map right now. This is a bad one. This is so bad. Where are the rings at? Okay, so when he's in 3D... Ugh! Oh, you watched the Sonic movie, I gotcha. <laughs> Have you seen- you've seen it before, right? Just gonna keep boosting. Boost seems to be unlimited, so we're just gonna boost. Yeah, you can home all you want, we're faster than you. Okay, so he's outside of the map. When he goes outside of the map, we gotta switch, right? Oh my gosh. I don't understand how I'm supposed to switch, it's not letting me switch now. I'm a, it's not switching. There we go, there's some rings. I mean, I know y'all are like, constantly encouraging me. But how about you offer me some more practical encouragement, like... Push the A button, and... Come on, come on. Like, I send him out, he hits things. Go! Get him! Get him! Bow! He's so close! Oh, great. Rings, rings. We got some. Okay, what does the homing shot do? Is that trying to teach me something? He shoots the homing shot a lot. They constantly... They're constantly talking about the homing shots. They're looking for rings. Here come some rings. Rocket! Switch in pursuit. Why? Why? What does it matter that we switch? Oh. 
all about boosting. Do I don't know. I'm trying. That's all I'm doing is boosting. Do I gotta hit that like sun-looking thing? Boost, boost, boost. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I can boost unlimited. It just seems weird that you have to just keep pushing the button. Ah, the rings! I mean, this seems kind of like... Wrong. Oh, it wasn't- so Lady Dragon, what did you think? It's not bad. They actually did a pretty good job with that movie. Okay, still boosting. Missing all the rings. They're so hard to pick up in three-dimensional mode. Really? Really? I just switched already. I need more rings. I really need more rings. Ugh. Okay, I got a few. Not even see them. Don't understand. Uh, missing all the rings. I'm about to die again. Ah! What? What are we missing here? Like, I could just spam the boost button. But that seems really annoying. It doesn't seem right. Okay, so I'm switching for some reason. I don't know why. Move up. Yeah, that's some good ringage. And that's the attack, so I think we just gotta get close enough. We got, we got close enough! A thing happened! Really? <laughs> Hit him, dude! What are you waiting on? Oh my gosh! Okay, what am I missing now? Now that I'm here... I can't get any closer. But well, we're gonna die. Maybe we shouldn't have switched yet. Oh, not to throw Sonic, just keep boosting. 
I missed all those rings. Are you serious? <laughs> I was like, I love how it's just like the internet says. <laughs> the rings! We're so close! Uh oh. Is that good? He's bleeding rings! This is so confusing. Okay, switch. Well, we got a hit. Ow. Are there any rings anywhere? I could use some more rings. The rings come up so fast, you never get a chance to see them coming. So if you just don't happen to be in the right spot, you don't get them. Boost, 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 boost! Come on, 20 seconds! Get in there! Ah! Oh. Come on! Get some rings! Get some rings! Oh, that's all we got? That's all we got? Okay, okay. Two hits. Grajink35, Seb6. That's okay. Thanks for stopping by, though. I hope you have a great Monday. He's on the outside again. Oh, we've got two hits. Oh shoot, some new something, new something. What? Oh, this is bad. Okay, he's got new attacks. We're definitely doing something right. Is he on the inside? Yeah, he's on the inside. I don't get how to do you just deal with it. Oh my gosh, 19 rings. I need a hit. Oh, all the rings are up there. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, boost. 10, 7, 6, 5, 4, the rings! Ah, one ring! No! <laughs> that should have counted. We totally hit him. We had rings. Oh my gosh, what is going on? Get away from me, all these debris things. This is so confusing. I know, right? Usually when we hit him like that, you get some rings out of it. Okay, we need a lateral. Come on, come on. Keep boosting. Ow. Keep boosting. Keep boosting. Keep boosting. Oh, we got hit. Keep boosting. The rings! We're so close. Come on. 
It's just like pure white noise at this point. <laughs> I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be dodging. But there's not really a dodge. Oh my gosh. Get in there. Come on. Okay, here we go. That's one. Couple rings. So this is challenge. This is hard, right? But not in an engaging, this is fun kind of way. Like I feel like they went a little creatively bankrupt here at the end of the game. I missed all those rings. I mean, it's okay. Like, it's cool, right? It's definitely cool. But from a mechanic standpoint, like, I feel like there's a lot more they could have done with this. There's two. Oh, we missed all- okay, there we go, we got some of them. It's like, really, we missed all of those? Eyes on the outside. Yes! Extra life! Oh, great. Switch modes already? Yes, he did. All right, get in there, get in there, guys. I mean, the one boss fight they give you like infinite boost is because you need infinite boost. Come on, come on. Ow. There's some rings. There's some more. Come on, buddy. Like, you can't even dodge. Like, the bumpers don't even let you, like, pull a dodge attack. Like, a, the dodge... Actual dodge. Come on. Come on. <sighs> See, that's cheap. Rah! Okay, three, three, three. <laughs> okay, he's got more than three hits. Dude, that's that's the sound effects of going through a time slow motion thing. Oh my gosh. Oh, we're just drilling through this meteor. That was cool. You doing it again? Toast, dude. I mean, they're just assuming the time flow will go back to normal. There's nothing that said that it would. A rank. Yeah, I, okay, like, I dig the game, but the last two boss battles have been rather anticlimactic. Still 
warm. Oh, and they have oh, nope. time travel. Nope, he remembers. I'm like they have no memory. I'll admit, you weren't half bad, Sonic. Half bad? Are you kidding? He was all great. He collects how many? Wow, where does somebody put all those gold rings? You know what? I don't know. I keep forgetting to ask. <laughs> hey, it was great teaming up with you. Hope you learned a few tricks that'll help you out in the future. I mean, the past. It, you know what I mean. Dude, sweet! And you're only gonna get better! Positive mindset. Ooh, okay. Post credit cutscene. Told you this is just like this is the MCU before the MCU did it. Hey Sonic! Enjoy your future! It's gonna be great! Well technically, once he gets old enough, won't this happen to him again when he becomes this Sonic? And folks, Sonic Generations. A little disappointing of a finish, but overall, fun. I, it still holds up in my opinion. Man, I need to find a way of uh, hooking <laughs> sliced bread cup. <laughs> uh. I need to find a way of being able to stream old consoles, like an actual Sega Genesis. It's sitting in the other room. I could dust it off, hook it up. There's, there's a lot of love, right, for the franchise, for the source material that was put into this. Like, you can just see how much the folks that really, either the designer or the person, the director, whoever worked on this game, like they really knew what made Sonic good, what made Sonic great. And I think they did a great job capitalizing on that. It could emulate, right? That's always an option. Man, I never, did anybody ever have Sonic and Knuckles in the Genesis, like the actual like double stack cartridge, where you had like the Knuckles cartridge, and then you slot the Sonic cartridge in on top? Or is it the other way around? I never had that one. Oh, here we go. These are a lot of the levels that, like, they took inspiration from. These are, like, the OG levels. Dude, did you have that? Really? I don't know, still up there. Still up there is one of my my favorite Sonic games. Now what more could you want? It's like hip, it's 90s rock and roll, and it's going as fast as you possibly can. You rented it. <laughs> oh, that was back in the day, man. I think we had a, I don't know, like a Rite Aid or something across from where I grew up, and they in the back they had like the rental video section, <laughs> and they had like a little section like bin that was like video games. They had like Sonic or Sega games I could rent stuff like that. Man, back in the day. Hey, I want to make a quick little shout out here to. Uh, Alexi78. 
I don't know if you're viewing today or if you were uh, popped in just over the weekend or not, but thanks for following the channel. I hope we're able to provide some entertainment for you, something fun, and be great if you could uh, feel free to join our conversation stuff. You don't have to, but feel free to be part of it. Love to have you. With, with Alexi78, that brings us up to 57 followers, folks. How wild is that? Has anyone ever made a Sonic cover band? They have some great tunes. Is that the one you were playing in college? When you got your Dreamcast? These are the levels that gave me some trouble. I guess it was a game just called Sonic the Hedgehog. To be honest, this looks actually harder than what they had in this game. Jeez. This is when Sonic got into his, like, emo punk years. Suddenly serious. Post apocalyptic, we need lava and explosions. Huh. We'll have to do like a, a Sonic September or something, right? A little retrospective. Well, this was cool. There was a little bit more to it than like just a simple, straightforward boss fight. It's so neat how how I mean, it's just like true to the source material they were. Looking at some of these levels, ah, and this is where the uh, the one the, with the oil and the spiky dudes, yeah. Sonic Colors. I never played that one. Getting toward the end here. That's when you jump off the airplane and you're like, bam. Ah. This must have been on one of his anniversaries when they came out with this. Marks. Are you sure you saw a door over here? What? You were the one who said you saw a door over here. Well, I know it was one of us. Shut up and keep looking. <laughs> it would only make that seem better if Jim Carrey's Dr. Robotnik came through. The exact same time as when you asked earlier, and it'll be the exact same time when you ask later. There is no time here! Let me just say that this was a brilliant plan that you came up with. 
Don't get too self-righteous. It'll be your plan pretty soon. I'm gonna dedicate the rest of my life to forgetting it. I heard that. Do we ever win? That depends on your definition of win. Beating Sonic. Oh, well then no. <laughs> that doesn't give me much hope. Maybe I'll go back and get my teaching degree. That's not a bad idea. I've always enjoyed telling people what to do. You got the custom skill, Super Sonic. And folks, that is it. Woo! Well, that was cool. Well, we've got... We've got about... A little over 20 minutes left. Let's just do some greatest hits here, right? Let's keep it going. Time break. I suppose we should go check out the upgrades. I mean, we haven't really touched it at all. Well, folks, that was our adventure through Sonic Generations. Hope you enjoyed it. A little blast into the past. That's what I'm going to go look. Okay, there's a time break. Slows down time temporarily. You can use it in Act 1 and Act 2. Hmm. I don't think you can buy Supersonic. Nope. Ah, it's a skill set though. So it is a skill. If I equip it, it's the only skill I can equip. So you can have up to 100 points in each skill slot. And basically, once you get 50 rings, you will become supersonic. Well, we gotta try that one. <laughs> it's only 50 rings, too. That's kind of neat how you tied it all into different different skills. All right, here we go. Let's try this out. We have no red rings in this world, so. Get our 50 gold rings here, and we'll see what happens. Well, we're just playing for some funsies now, folks. The game's finished. Ooh, wow, that's kind of interesting with them in the background like that. There's a red ring right there and I missed it. Are you serious? I got 36. That feels like there's some missing stuff above me. Maybe not. Man, you know, you just like stop and take a moment to appreciate the level. Like when you're racing through it at breakneck speed, you don't really get to see it and appreciate it for what it is. Oh, that's 50 rings! Okay, how do we do it? <laughs> I guess I didn't look up how to actually use Supersonic. Oh no! Oh! Yep! I gotcha. So normally, you have to find the little checkpoint things, then like, you j they would create like, a star area. Crouch, spin jump, spin dash. 
Did I not equip the skill thing? I thought I equipped it. Hey, Wolfskatog! Thanks for stopping by! Crazy busy, but I hope it's a good crazy busy. Oof, got another one. This is pretty cool. Oh! There's a thing up there. Oh no! There's a red ring up there. Will that bug come back? No, he won't come back. <laughs> no, I gotcha. There we go, we got it. Oh, I didn't even see him. He totally blended in. Oh, really? We missed that? So maybe I didn't equip the, the skill set here. And that wasn't so bad. Doo -doo -doo. I'm sending you positive vibes, good sir. Wishing you the best today. Maybe I didn't equip the skill. We got three of the red rings. Omo Chow. Skill set A is equipped. Customize. Ah, I does not have it. I never confirmed it. Okay, now it's equipped. Let's try that again. Try this again. Man. Like this this level has just the greatest jam. Like whoever invented this song. They were onto something. I wanna live in their head. Ooh, a tiny thing, but I love the fact that you can actually hear his footprints against the metal grating. That's different. Woo, there we go. Being able to hear his pitter-pattery shoes on the metal is a really cool effect. Ah! Oh! That's why I went into ball mode. To avoid that happening. Just a robot arm in the background. Take the road less traveled. Nice! And that's what you're rewarded with. Red rings. Where are the actual rings at, though? Woo! Water slide. Oh my gosh. Oh, great. I remember this. Okay, 26. This level does not have as many rings as the other ones did. Woo! Oh, great. Come on. So close! Please don't hit something, like all those spikes. 
Oh, are you kidding me? <laughs> we got a red ring out of it. I can't complain. S rank, S rank. Bam. If we go back to Green Hill Zone. We got two red rings out of it. Awesome. Okay, I want to see what the supersonic thing does. Still two red rings waiting. It means two paths that we haven't taken before. Six already. There we go. Press Y to supersonic. Oh, that's super cool. Am I invincible? I'm totally invincible. Can I juice? Oh, I can juice and everything. Oop, that was a red ring too. I almost screwed up that bridge that time. I basically hover though. I fly. How cool is that? And it burns my rings. So as long as I keep getting rings... I'm okay. Oh my gosh. I mean, going backwards is not the, not the best idea. Huh. Seriously? I died? Supersonic died? Okay, so Supersonic's pretty cool. You're basically invincible. As long as you have rings. It's like a permanent shield. Ugh. Come on. I need to get back up. Oh, great. Of course that broke. Here, maybe this is another red ring area. Maybe. Ooh, not enough speed. There we go. Woo! Oh, I've been here before. I'm not 100% sure where the last one might be waiting at gone up before. We'll go down this time. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Ooh, have not gone up this way, I don't think. Ugh, supersonic! Just in time to beat the level. Oh, we got an achievement for that, too. Oh, he's even in supersonic mode at the end. That's cool. Okay, so the supersonic's a pretty neat, neat touch. Four red rings. I'm not doing too bad. And there's all the things you can earn by doing the challenges collecting the music and there's there is so much to this game as far as collectibles completionist kind of stuff if you're looking for a really if you're looking for something fun spend some time with folks I would highly recommend this game especially if you are a Sonic fan Just listen to that music. Look at those beautiful backgrounds. No, jump down. Oh, I missed it. Are you kidding me? Whoop. 
Super Sonic! We're not gonna find a single red ring, are we? Ooh, I see you over there. Can we get up there? Oh, you gotta reverse it. Interesting. And there was a cloud. Oh, how do we get over there? How do we get to that stuff? I guess that was it. Oh, that's different. Uh-oh, it's breaking, it's breaking! That's interesting. bouncy thing go I'm so confused what bounce Really? There's some speed behind this one. There's clearly not enough speed. Where are the red rings? We didn't get a single one. Man, I keep missing all these little poppity doos. Go. Go! Oh! Not enough go, go, go. There's red ones. How do we get over there? Not like that. Not by stopping and jumping. There's two red rings out there. It's totally a different path you have to take. Oh my, oh my, oh my. So how do you get to that path? Is the question. It's gotta be a completely different part of the level. No, 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 no! Hey, have a good one, Jose. Thanks for stopping by, man. Enjoy the rest of your day. Happy Monday. A 
there's two rings waiting here at the end of this path. If you know how to get over there. Question is, I don't know how to get over there. That was a pretty rough one. All right, we got a little bit less than 10 minutes here, folks. That's the last two, actually, too. Look, there's three red stars. There's only two of them left, and they're at the end of the level on those two ramps. Hmm. So I know where they're at, and it seems like you have to play at least twice more before you can earn them. All right, we got to wrap it up with a little city escape here. There's the drift. Oh, I missed it. Tricks I can do here? I swore there was tricks I could do. Oh, I missed it. See, that's... So much you miss. This game is. Ah, we're just having fun, Jader, right? We beat the game, so we're just going back and just hitting some fun levels just to wrap up the last few minutes here of the stream. Taking our time having fun with it. That was bad. Yeah, that's a <laughs> that is a good way to describe it, actually. Oh, jeez. Don't know what we're missing. Now we're at the end of the level, basically. I'm just outrunning this guy. But I didn't find any red rings. My eyes are oh there is one act there. There's one on the left. If somehow you can get on the left side of that path, there is a red ring up there. Man, I want a truck like that.
Hey! TLBG14. Hello and happy Monday. What is the Eggman Land Challenge? Alright, we got three minutes here, folks. We're gonna do one more. One more pass, and that'll be it for us today. That'll be our adventures in Sonic Generations. The Eggman Land Challenge. I mean, that sounds pretty dope. I've never heard of it. That's definitely a thing. Oh, come on. I'm missing everything. Oh, no. Oh, no. game With the unleashed hunt all right I'm gonna have to look that up because that's a lot of stuff that I don't even know man <laughs> it's a mod which means we could do it because we're on PC here I want that. I want that. Hey, Eggman Lynch. I'm gonna look this up. I'm gonna have to look this up. Run, run. Got him. Ranker. Okay, yeah. Say something. Definitely something to look up. If you've got it on your channel, I'll have to check it out. Because that sounds really intriguing. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. Woo! We made it. Ah! Oh, we missed that one. So much for the skateboard. Dang. That would have been cool. Ooh, this is okay. probably a bottomless pit. Whoa! We were a little late to that party. Definitely not moving fast enough. Oh my. Oh! Is there a red ring up here at the top? That'd be so cool. Jeez, how high does this go? Oh, there's nothing up here? Except one heck of a view. And an invisible wall. Oh, is it, is it auto censored or whatever? Is the stream tied to your name? It's not giving me the option to uncensor that. If I can follow your account and find it, though, definitely. Bum, 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 bum. Let me take a look here. Oh, though as soon as I click the button, we're gonna exit out. Though I know that. Mm 
Bloop. Back to the Steam page. Being a C-Rank. TLBG, I'm, I'm going to check that one out. I'll follow your username and check it out. Maybe that's something we'll throw on the channel. Maybe that's something we'll throw on the channel here. Oh, all right, folks. That wraps up our adventures for today. Thank you so much for spending your Monday morning here with me at Quarters Without Borders. Um, we had two stages, our two boss stages we went through. We had a 10-minute, three-second clear that had a times three multiplier and a five minute 21 second clear that had a times six multiplier so we're looking at like 30 quarters and another 30 quarters so like 60 more quarters onto that total today and we're already sitting at 56 dollars going to charity so i have that of course officially updated for everybody come tomorrow stream remember we're streaming tuesday wednesday and thursday this week all at 11 a.m eastern standard time we'll have our official total brought up for um, ba, 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 child's play. And yeah, we'll be starting a new adventure. Something a little heavier, right? This is kind of a nice little palate cleanser, an appetizer, a digestive, so to speak, after all of our efforts going through Bloodborne. So something a little more relaxed, something a little bit more um, fun for a week. And back into it tomorrow, folks. Back into it tomorrow. It's exciting, it's exciting. Hints, huh? Oh, man. <laughs> oh, the hints take away all the fun. The hints, hints take away all the fun. Okay, let me think. Let me think here. Because the, the, the first two hints that come to mind would give it away immediately. I know... Dr. Maganya is not on the stream right now, but if he was, this has been the game that he has been requesting for like the last six months, like legitimately since we started playing The Last of Us Part Two, he's been requesting this game. Um, he's gonna be a little bit further to chew on that. Okay, we'll put it this way: there is a sequel coming out on next gen consoles. It's not out yet. But it's coming out on next-gen consoles. I won't say what console it's coming out on or what platform it's coming out on, but there is a sequel. This is a game that came out in the current generation, the PS4 and the Xbox One generation. First game. And the sequel is coming out. How about that? How about that? Ah, I gotcha. Yeah, so there's a sequel and... um. Kind of true to form we play as a female protagonist we fa play as a female protagonist so hopefully that's, that's enough to chew on without giving too much away um but something a little a little with a little more meat on its bones um than say our game play through sonic so something fun we'll have a new charity of course and jumping back into it tomorrow so um ladies and gentlemen everybody thank you for coming out and supporting thank you for coming out hanging out thank you for coming out and having a good time i hope so Jade right, of course, may the Emperor protect and bless the rest of your evening. TLBG14, thanks for stopping by. I will definitely have to take a look at what that Eggman Land challenge is. That's not something cool. Maybe it's even something that we could we could do on the channel. Um, but you know, thanks for bringing it up. Thanks for mentioning it. And if anyone wants to check out what um, TLBG14 is doing, check out their 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 stream, their stream on Twitch. Follow their username. Um, Wolf's Katag and Oh Hey It's Jose, as well as Lady Dragana. Thank you, everybody, for coming out this afternoon. Um, yeah, enjoy the rest of this magnificent Monday. And I hope to catch you on the flip side, Tuesday morning at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Until then, as always, stay safe, folks, and happy gaming.